Last week at Sheep Mountain Raceway, we finished third, and Scott Speed got his second win on the season. Now, before we can go to Lucas Oil Raceway, we have to make our late model debut. Yes, you guys heard that correctly. We are making our late model debut, and uh, I'm really happy about that because, you know, when we're done with this SRX season, you never know what other opportunities are going to get us. We could get a super truck picked up, or we could get an SRX, not an SRX, a late model ride picked up. So we want to make this start. Um, we're making another one at the end of the season at, yeah, we're going to make another start at the end of the season. And then here in a couple weeks, we're going to do our stadium truck debut as well. So let's get down to Lucas Oil for practice with the late model. We are here at Lucas Oil in a late model for our debut here. Um, I am feeling super good about this. Um, very good about this. Very happy that we're, I'm able to make this. Um, start here um it's gonna be fun um luckily the, 50, the number 54 is not being used so we are able to use that and they actually qualify in this series it's not just a uh, it's not just practice to heat races um because i don't think there is heat races in this series um I could be wrong, but I don't think that there is any heat series, not heat series, but I don't think there's any heat races in this series. This is very fun. Um, so the late model season is only, I think, 10 or 11 weeks long, so um, it's going to be quite fun, actually doing this season that's only if we are able to get um you know valvoline and some of our partners that are actually on this car are able to come with us for um this season so hopefully that is able to happen everything is looking really good um i think we're gonna end up practice here in just a little bit and uh, then we are gonna move on to qualifying and see see where we go um, maybe we can win in our debut um, that would be really cool but um, I, I, I don't know if, if that's gonna happen or not so we did seven laps of practice and um, our fourth lap was the fastest lap that we had, which, I mean, actually kind of surprising. Um, so we're going to jump into qualifying right now and see what happens. Qualifying is underway. Um, I'm not 100% sure how many laps we actually have for this qualifying run, but we're going to try and give it our all here um i think we might we might get one lap two laps okay we have two laps to do this so hopefully it's all good and we don't run the wall or do anything like that um it would be nice if we can get pole that would be really really nice uh, um, if I can get pulled, that would be really nice, especially for being our debut up into the wall just a little bit. We're not going to get the pole. Have not lifted it at all. Where are we going to cross the line? 14th. Yikers. Yikes. Okay. Um, I mean, that's pretty good at a 25 car feel. That's pretty good good um but man i was not expecting us to 
I mean, we're not that bad for qualifying. We're really not. We're not that bad off, but I was... 14th, honestly, is not bad. Eddie Crawford gets the pole for the main event. Let's jump right into it. We are green for our first late model debut. Well, for our late, not our first debut. Wow, for our late model debut. I'm not really sure how well we are gonna be um, in this series. Uh, needs to be on the bottom lane we really haven't moved too much we're gonna try not to make too many enemies out here either we're gonna go three wide maybe no nope, we're gonna back out that guy's just gonna try and drive completely through us not sure what the deal was there where we're making up ground slowly making up ground Which is kind of what we want. We're just gonna not. We're just not gonna lift in any of these corners here and like see what happens. But anyways, that might help us out in the, the long run. Um, I don't think. Here, um, it, 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 it's possible that we could. But honestly, I highly, highly doubt that we are. Um, I'm it right now. So these, yeah, that right front. She get yeah. me using him up as much as I did like that, which you know that is 100% my fault there. Um, seven laps to go here. I'm feeling pretty good. Um, I like the car. I like the way that it's set up. Um, I just wish that, you know, I didn't wear out my tires as much as I did there. That right front tire not looking good whatsoever. We are really going to have to learn a tire management here. Getting straight driven through here. Not liking that with five laps to go. <clears throat> that right front is absolutely gone. Four laps to go. We've caught up back to ninth place we're gonna pass ninth place here and maybe even get tenth i put him up into the wall sorry not sorry we go into the wall as well three laps to go we've dragged pretty much the whole field back to us now we just got to play the aggressive blocking game if i'm even able to do that we got the 86 up top, I'm going to send him way up wide, and we are going to run the grass just a little bit there. We're going to slide up two laps to go in our debut, a 12th place finish. Yikes. And, oh, smacking that outside wall. White flag is out for the leaders. We fall back to 17th. 17th is what we fall back to. 
now 17th. And the leader is going to come around and get the win. We're going to completely fence somebody. Carnage. Right now, we are 21st. We, we just got lapped, boys. This is not a good look for us whatsoever. We're going to come across the line spinning 25th position. Yikes. Crawford ended up getting the win. Um, led every single lap of this race. All I have to say is yikes. Now it is time to come back to our bread and butter, which is this SRX series, um, yes, the, this SRX series, um, so what we need to do is we need to come out here and win in front of the exact same crowd that we just completely embarrassed ourselves out of because, man oh man, that was horrible. Let's do some practice and jump into the first heat. Making our first lap here at Lucas Oil for the SRX series. Um, oh, this should be fun. Oh boy. Alright, we're setting our people up into the wall already. Not really wanting to do that. We're probably going to run like closer to the amount of the same times as we did in the late model race that would not be that would not surprise me at all wrecking at Tony Stewart up in it she with the wall will we go that's gonna end our practice Green flag is out. Heat one. Um, this race is a bit shorter than what they normally are. That's last week's winner of Scott Speed. Hopefully, uh, I mean, it'd, it'd be kind of nice if uh, we can get another driver. I think that's Tony Stewart that's gone around. I don't know why the caution has not waved just yet um i think that's tony stewart i could be wrong there not sure what happened to that car looks like maybe a flat tire or something like that there's only two orange cars out here and it looks like that that was tony stewart who got that bad end um yikes not looking good for tony stewart right now Hopefully he can turn it around in the second heat. Down here, um, that is, we're going to try and make that work. We've got a new face here in the SRX series at Lucas Oil. we got two laps to go here. Go around. Looks like he's can. He's gonna leave the door open, and we are going to take it. Leave that bottom. Don't let him have the bottom, and we are going to finish second in the first heat. Green flag is out. We have better... Okay, so we I get it now. We have better restarts on the concrete and asphalt ovals than we do dirt which makes sense i can't confirm that i 
That kind of sucks that he's already lost the lead, but... Oh, well, I guess. Just a handful of laps. We're going to get down below Scott's speed here. We're going to get him maybe... Ernie Francis Jr. setting in our sights. Can we get Ernie Francis Jr.? Hopefully we can, but it'd be nice for him to get his first um, heat win of the season. So I don't know even if... I don't even know if we're going to get there, to be completely honest with you guys. Tagged to the wall just a little bit there. Two laps to go. I don't think we're going to be able to get Ernie Francis Jr. here. He might pick up the heat when we're closing. We're going to run up high. The high line. Not going to do it. Got to pedal it through three and four. Final lap of the second heat. Who is it going it to be? If he gives me the bottom in here, which he kind of does, but we're not going to do anything. We will settle for a second. Ernie Francis Jr. is going to win the second heat. Starting on the pole. Um... Not sure why. Um, this race is 11 laps, um, a little bit uh, shorter than what it normally would be because of the late model race that we had. Now, if we can come out here and literally dominate this whole entire race and get our fifth win on the season, that would be quite amazing, especially because of the fact that, you know, we... We just embarrassed ourselves with that with with that late model debut. We <laughs> completely embarrassed ourselves. That was that was absolutely horrible. Like I I never I never want to do that again. Like maybe we will come out here and literally just like smoke the whole field. That looks like it looks like that that's what we're gonna do right now. Um, like, I, I don't know what else we're really going to do here besides just completely drive away from these guys. I did make the mistake of burning up our tires in the... Um, late model race and our late model debut i did make that mistake unfortunately so a little bit slidey we got kind of near the end um we just gotta save the tires bobby labane gets into second place you were heat one winner six laps to go Am I feeling pretty good right now? We got five laps to go. I've led every single lap of this race. Um, yeah, I have no idea what we're gonna be doing here. Like, I don't know. We just, just like this is redemption for what we just did earlier. What we did earlier was absolutely embarrassing. What we what we're doing now is telling all the team owners and everybody in the late models that we can win that we can win we have talent and that we can actually do it with three laps to go
two laps to go from Lucas Oil. Um, having a blast right now. Now my tires are wearing, but we only got one more time around here. We're going to get up into that wall just a little bit. Nothing too bad there. Not very good way to take the white flag, but we did. Um, white flag is out. Just a couple more turns, and we are going to get our fifth victory of the season. Coming out of three and four onto the front straightaway, we are going to win for the fifth time this season. Let's go. Final results. We get the dub. Man, getting your fifth win is absolutely amazing. Let's go. Almost a hundred points separating me and Tony Stewart. That is absolutely insane if we scroll down here. Obviously, you guys are going to see that, you know, it goes and um, the points do come down um i don't know if we're gonna get to all these guys um there's i think want to say like 60 61 people and about half of them have actually like man like i'd say a good bit of them don't have points but you know what that is okay because we are the points leader and uh we got five wins on the season that is nice and uh I'm still wondering, will Tony Stewart get a win, or is he just going to go winless this whole season? Finished first at Lucas Oil. Next week we go to Keon County. Yeah, Ke Ke Keon. Keon County. That's what we're going to go with. Um, no more. Um, no, no other races on until Durango Park, and we make our stadium truck debut um depending on how durango park and um nashville go um that's going to kind of depend on but we have two series that we can race in and that's the late models and the stadium trucks so i don't really know which one we're gonna go to which series we are gonna go to i would like to go to the late models but if nobody wants to, if nobody wants to pick us up then unfortunately we probably are gonna have to go to the um stadium trucks or we are literally going to have to um just do like a part-time season or maybe we can do another season in this and in this series but um not 100 percent sure if i want if i would want to do that but with that further ado guys that's going to be it for today's video don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe share with friends if you enjoyed if you're interested in getting a gaming computer please click the link in the description below this video and you guys can use code squad sq at uad get to 10 percent off guys 10 percent off of an eight thousand dollar computer or just really anything nowadays saves you a lot of money so please click that link use code squad sq uad for 10 percent off and uh, i've been streaming for 40 minutes now recording this video so um should it be fun um sorry for this being a longer srx video but you know what it is what it is peace out and i will see you guys in the next one yeah.